Hello, my name is Minda Chakalashi and welcome to this tutorial. In this lesson, I am going to talk about the Paint Bucket tool. The Paint Bucket tool will be your companion as you draw a few color in your vector image layers. When you open up a new window, you will notice that in the toolset panel, the Paint Bucket tool is not there. You can only access the Paint Bucket tool once you have a vector image in your working space. Once you click and drag your drawing shape vector layer in the workspace, this opens up the Paint Bucket axis. The Paint Bucket axis has a menu above which include Auto Fill and Auto Stroke. Like the name applies, by selecting Auto Fill, this will apply color automatically to the vector shape that you are going to draw and drag in the workspace. Similarly with the stroke, color will be automatically added to the outline of your image. Once you have drawn and dragged your vector image, the paint bucket has the following option above. You can either select fill or you can either select stroke or you can either select both. Depending on what you want, you can select the above for you to change color. In order for me to demonstrate how the paint bucket option work, I'll start by selecting the paint bucket tool then I'll click on the image, scroll above and tick or select stroke. Then I'll go to my style and antique fill. Then I will click on the image. In order for us to see the effect, I'll go on the file, select and click. And I'll scroll down on my preview and click. And there you can see our image has only a stroke outline. It is important to remember that the Paint Bucket tool can only fill color when the shape is closed. For now, that is the basic of how to use the Paint Bucket. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Support me by subscribing to this channel, writing a comment below or clicking the like button. Once more, thank you.